What is up? I am back. I am playing uh, the demo for School of Magic. Uh, it's a new roguelike. Um, like dungeon crawler deck builder. So it's a mashup of a bunch of genres. Uh, but it looks really cool. Uh, You can hear the game, you can hear my voice. Let me double check that you can hear the game. Yeah, you can. All right. Default microphone. Okay. Give me one second. Let me check that. Oh, I've been uh, given the game, uh, the demo key from uh, the developer. Uh, hopefully, they'll give me the full key when it's released. I really thought it was the full key when I was activating it. Uh, uh, it's just the demo. Thank you. Pretty much play the demo. It's just not the it doesn't say demo. It says now I'm getting bombed with. A ton of fake people. Great. I got to report all those. Alright, well, great. Now I have to go report all that when uh, I'm done. I'm so, getting so mad that Twitch is just not doing anything about this problem. It's irritating. You get bombed with a bunch of um, people, bots following you and stuff. It's just really, really annoying. It only happens really in the first like ten minutes. First, how long have I been streaming? Less than three minutes. Within the first five minutes. I haven't gotten in it for a while. They they follow and then they unfollow. So it's really annoying. And then that just clogs up my followers list. And I actually made it for a bunch of other stuff. So annoying. Throws off my algorithm too, like how many followers I get and stuff. <sighs> Twitch, please fix that. That's all I want to say. Alright, I'll turn on the Twitch follower notification again. Alright, so let's get into the game. Maybe there's a controller. Should probably try that. This is 
controller not set up. Probably not. What about this one? Controller. So this game is currently not out yet. It does not have a release date, as far as I can see. Um, this is wish list now under release date. Okay. Um. I think it's made by only one person. Looks pretty fun though. It does not have controller support. Okay. So it's click base only. That's good to know. You can interact with the out, yellow outline stuff. All right. So uh, I hope you are ready to start your intrix exam. I'll play this for about an hour till 12. The exam to school, what do you apply for? What well, should I be taking about? Unless the demo ends. Oh, I can only do nature. I can't do chaos. Or wisdom. I can only do these two options. Nature. Sorry, but you only have to start your interest exam now. Talk later. All right. School of Magic. So it feels like a traditional, like, dungeon crawler that I'm playing right now. Where's the card? How does the cards work? That's what I really want to know. Because... Okay. Now, how do I attack? Okay. You got a level... Click on the plus sign. Mana cost cooldown. Name description. It's a little bit blurry. Card level. Teleport you to any place on the screen. Okay, that's cool. Definitely see why this is still in beta. Still being developed. Oh, it cleared up a little bit. Deal 10 damage to 20. 20 damage and burn an enemy. How do I? Wizard 101? No, it's not Wizard 101. I have to pick one of these. Wait, I can't even read that. I can't read the 
little thing. Deal three damage three times to eight damage every one second. Yeah, I can't read that. <laughs> Uh, sell for I don't know. I think this is 300? Uh, maybe a one? <laughs> uh, how do I get out of this? The spell will be automatically assigned to your spell bar. Close the menu to now. Alright. I'm dying. Your life reaches zero, you will die. Well, yes, I know that. I uh, like that. Obvious, but. Right click. Oh, to cast. Okay. You now assign the map on the other menu here. Open the map by clicking on the map icon. What's this streak right here? Is that my monitor? No, I don't. I definitely don't think it's on my monitor. Nope. That is definitely the game. Okay. Oh! The resolution's really terrible. Oh. Slip that to 10 AP at least. That's not 1080. Uh, 1920 by 1080. On 60 hertz. There we go. Now I can actually see everything. Quality high. Wow. Okay, definitely, definitely, definitely. That just improves the game a lot. Alright. That looks a lot better. I don't know why it would do the lowest resolution possible. In why does it not adjust to your resolution on your monitor? Or your lowest monitor, at least. Whenever you blow up, random spell is removed. Okay. Our main spells weak any level. And three new random Selected spells are added. To make it really complicated. I get I get one removed, but I get three added. <laughs> okay. Increase your damage by four percent whenever you level up. All right. All right. Now how do I pick another card? Increase. Well, I just did that. Chaos has a black card border. Nature has a brown border. Card border. Wisdom has blue card border. Huh. Can I 
I add more spells to my hopper? That's what I want to do. So it's just, it walks to the point that you're tell it to. I haven't played this type of game in a while. Steam Deck. Facebook. Uh, I want to use this another spell. You can assign one, two, three, four, five more spells. It looks like. How do I do it? I have no idea. Be honest. Can you just like select all these? I got two new spells over here. How do I do that? I don't even know what that icon is. What's that icon? I know it says one and two. Why did it change? What did I... I pressed two when it changed. Oh, it's because I activated it. Side. Wonder now what what is that icon? How do I? Is that just the, oh that's the right click. Okay. Gain two of the falling abilities at random. Your maximum life is reduced by 150. You lose 300 experience points. You have a 15% increased chance to win a critical chance. You receive... One of these is terrible. Oh, two of these are terrible. What? No. Oh, okay, well. I have a really high chance of getting a terrible one. I guess. I'll take one of those. You receive 15% less damage, and you 
have a 15% increase. Well, both of those sound good. That's good. Thank you. We got lucky. I guess. That is going in a circle. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I've already been going that way. Yeah, I need to go this way, I think. But I, I honestly don't even know which way to go. It doesn't even tell me. I know I've been this way, so let's just go this way. Oh, they weren't close enough. Now I'm getting really hit. Let's get in there. You now sell and level cards for gold. Click on any card. You will now open a menu. Increase your maximum life by 350. That's pretty good. Whenever an enemy takes damage, you increase your armor for. I can't learn that. Huh. How do I know when I can learn? Spell points indicate how many spells you can learn right now. Okay. So that's the log thing. You are level currently have... I can't learn any more spells. But I didn't increase my health. That's pretty good. Uh, the treasure has a weird glow to it. Almost as if it has enhanced and... You ask yourself why nobody has taken it. Uh, yeah. I believe that there. There's dead bodies around it. Eh. Even if I fight it something. It's not bad. Hey, where are you going? That was good. So I have to figure out where I'm supposed to go now in this dungeon.
talk to that guy. Don't know where to go. Oh, I did it. I had my mic muted. I was surprised. <laughs> There's a ton of enemies here than me. Alright, let's go back over there. So you don't heal unless you're not around the enemies. Okay, that's good. Don't have enemies chasing you, you heal. Good to know.
I know this is the right way to go. I think this one is going to get an answer or something. It's freezing. Yeah, they're back here. Oh, it's bad. It's bad. Oh, there's way more. I die here. Failed. Yeah, of course. Hello, my name is Faz, uh, and I can teach you new spells. If you ask me, nature spells are the best, but I can teach you everything else. How can I help you? Show me what you have to offer. I've... I've, uh... Twelve knowledge I can spend. Select a spell of magic. Decrease the mana cost of all spells from that selected school. Huh. When this game comes fully out, and if I can get actually the full game, then it. I think this game will be really fun. It'll be a grind, of course, yeah. Roguelikes are always grindy. Uh, you max... Roguelites, whatever. It doesn't matter. Rogue games. The maximum mana is decreased by... Your spells will travel through the first enemy and your maximum mana is decreased by... Why do I want to decrease my mana? I don't want to decrease my mana. I want to do peace of mind. A spawn. Your maximum mana is decreased. If you kill 
n enemy within the next n five seconds, you will get n times n times 10 experience points. Okay, does the end get filled in when I pick the card? I'm going to do teleportation. No. Alright, to the school. Ne the next trial. It's a different randomly generated map. You can already tell. Should I learn? Shoot a projectile flying through all enemies, dealing 15 to 30 damage. 35 damage, I would say. That's better than that. Do that. You don't need a starter spell. Oh, maybe I did. Oh, wow. The cooldown for this is so long. I should have read that. Alright. That thing's dead. Well, it's going to die. When I get my... I'll get a root starter spell. When... I'm going to start a spell now. Whenever an enemy takes damage, you have a 31% chance to gain 7 experience. You gain 350 experience points. Whenever an enemy attacks you, increase your damage for 4 seconds by gain 1 of 2 falling ability. Is that random? That's cool. Whenever you gain a level, you receive twenty-five or two percent less damage. Huh. I guess that's good to take early on because let's start stacking when you level up. It just increases. Let's go back down here. It's very unique. Uh, 
game. Is that the first game that's done dungeon crawling with how you pick the cards and stuff? Is this This one has a lot of potential. You get 20% extra experience points. Select a school of magic, decrease the mana cost of all spells from the selected school by 20%. Let's do nature. Or uh, cooldown of all spells, reduce the cooldown of all spells. That's better, actually. Cooldown. The minimum cooldown of any spell is... Keep that in mind. I think my starter spell has more cooldown pull than my big spell. No, it does not. Alright, this could be good, or be bad. You receive 15% less damage, and you have a 15% chance to land a critical strike. That was the same thing last time. Alright, let's see. I guess if you pass the... file the test then I you uh beat the demo increase your maximum life points it can be good Increase the damage of all spells by 10%. That's great. Yeah. They're just dropping like flies now. Hey, the map looks the same as it did when I... Huh. Maybe... Different? No, it has to be different. So I spawned in an area that I... Is the map right Probably it is. So I don't know. I've never seen this. Your eyes are so beautiful and tasty. Oh no. He is here. Leave me. Spells heal. 10% more damage. I just lost some vision by gaining more damage. Gain one of the two falling. Increase damage. All spells reduce the cooldown of the spells. That's both pretty good. Uh, 
I think that when I level up, uh, the cards level up too. Yeah, they do. Okay. So, yeah. I don't really need more spells, I just need... Especially these, I don't really need another one that shoots. Uh, AoE would be nice, but I haven't got that yet. Cooldown on all spells? That sucks, but whatever. It is reduced a lot. Yeah, it is randomly generated. Is they have the same elements. Makes sense. Oh, my name is Madam Sia. I see here and know everything. Do you want me to tell you what the future has in store for you? These spells are good enough. to learn something else. If these will be the next spells for you to learn. If you dislike them, I can change your future. Just... Oh! Yeah, the, these spells are good. I wasn't even reading it. I <laughs> can read this stuff. Well, it's really hard to see now because I took the vision thing. It's supposed to do a lot more damage though. I don't really care if I'm in the middle. Oh! I think I died. Yeah, I died. All right. Well, every single time you die, it looks like like more area until it's done. What is this area now? Deck editor.
Okay, so you can actually edit the deck. Hmm. Hmm. Now there's a lot more dialogue options. I decided to create a magical world where we test our student candidates, and as you can see, we are not quite finished yet, but if you come back later, you should see progress. Time flies. Sorry, but you have to start your entrance exam now. You can talk later. Alright. This will be my last time. When I die this time, I'm gonna get off. Oh, I forgot to select the spell. I like the poison. And AoE is nice. That's my second spell. Oh wait. That's not an AoE. What is that? Whenever you, an enemy attacks you, he takes... Oh! That's nice too. Especially early on. Whenever an enemy takes damage, you increase your armor. Your projectile spells have a 50% chance to knock back an enemy. Eh, those are my favorite. Shoot a projectile flying through all enemies, dealing 15, one, 15 to 35% damage. Increase your maximum level by your maximum life by 200. That's great. I guess I'll do this. Life is important. I guess I can just make the starter spell OP. That's pretty good. Increased damage of all spells by 15%. That's great. That's actually what I wanted. I bet there's a boss that you have to get to. You, your life, you gain 150 life whenever an enemy dies. Whenever you gain a level, increase your maximum mana by 50. Huh. Reduce the cooldown of all spells by 10%. Select a random... Hmm. Whenever an enemy takes damage, whenever an enemy takes damage, you increase your armor. 
by 2% stacking up to Huh. That sounds cool. Sounds like the best out of them all. Now I have armor. Whenever I damage enemy. All I have to do is damage enemy. I take one of those. I'll take one of those. You lose 300 experience points. That sucks. Uh, you receive 15% less damage. That's pretty good. That's worth it. Even though I lost experience points. I've already leveled up, so I'm just leveled up. So it doesn't really matter. You're, you receive 10% less damage, thick skin, definitely want that. And so I want to make myself a tank. Uh, hello, my name is... Alright, right that. Name one of the following abilities. Gold. Or you gain a level, you gain gold. What's this last one? Create a, a shrine of nature that lasts for 15 seconds. Whenever you stand inside the shrine, you get 75% increased experience points and your damage is increased by 40%. That's pretty cool. Well, suppose they're cool. I want that one. The last one.
take that crown. Let's go. I need to set that down the shrine. I don't remember to do that. I know. You will not find any better price around. This is a shockkeep thing. Increase the damage of all spells by 10%. What if I buy this and this is the random one that gets deleted? That would suck. Well, that's pretty cool. Increase your maximum level by life by fifty. Want that and that. Oh, you can actually buy the spells. They get activated. I'm just gonna buy all three of them. I'm gonna spend all my gold. This is beta, this game. This game's in beta still. It's pretty good for being in beta. It's a fun game. The crater did not say anything about like that I can't show anything off too. Right. There's no stipulation on that. Twelve to twenty-five damage to all enemies nearby and burn them. I would like to get to a boss fight. I want to see what the a boss looks like. If there is a boss, there has to be a boss. It could be endless. Could be. No, I can't buy spells. I don't have money. I do, but 
Very little. Oh, there's a bigger portion over here. Back here. I think I already went that way, though. Did I not? Or is it only unlock the areas that you've been to? Yeah. Uh, let's go over here. Now what am I supposed to do? I pretty much explored the whole map, I think. There's some area over there. Yeah, you have to explore the map to unlock the areas. So the path's over here. I'll go over that. Actually, don't know how to read this map. How do I get down there? Oh, it's that skull thing. I see it. Where have I been this way? There was that was a dead end up there. Have to go this way. There has to be more to the map because, yeah, like I've never been to this area. Huh, that thing's down there. I don't think I'm in a circle. Huh. Oh. It's down there. It reflects off. It's on top, but it reflects to the bottom. That's pretty cool.
I have to be approaching near the end. Oh, shoot. damage you have a five percent chance to cast a rain of fire deal to all enemies nearby and burning them uh that sounds cool a ring of fire there. I do have one potion. One gets an end though. Do you want to start the next section of your intrix exam? So this is the end. Well, let's see what the next section is like. Unless the demo ends here. Good to end here. Oh, it's a boss fight. Oh, nope, it's end of the demo. Congrats, you have reached the end of the demo. The full game will include more enemies, bosses. I am a fight boss, uh, level types, spells, and encounters. You will be able to get the end to the end of the full experience. Wish nest now, play again, or exit. So, I'm gonna get off now. Uh, thanks for watching, I really appreciate it. Uh, I, I really enjoyed this game. It was a fun game. Uh, it sucked at the beginning, it was really low resolution. And, but I, I fixed that by setting 1080p, and it played really nice. It was a nice looking game. Uh, it's made by like only one person, I think, or a small team of people. If there is any more other people. Uh, thank you developer for giving me the key for the demo. Uh, really appreciate that. Uh, hopefully I can get the full game when it comes out. Uh, Alright. Later. <laughs>